the Audi Q2 offers a brand new experience. Audi have extended their Q range by offering this compact SUV, which is designed to be youthful and rugged. So I'm gonna show you what makes the Q2 such a unique car. Polygonal in design around the car, let's take a look at some of those sharp and edgy design elements. For instance, the octagonal design single frame, the wedge-shaped LED headlights, wherever you look, the car feels sporty. The low roof line, the high window line, concave flanks and short overhangs oozes confidence and energy. And all this is topped off with the C-pillars that come with colour offset blades so you can personalise your Q2. Another option is the LED lights with dynamic indicators at the rear of the car. And whilst we're here, let's take a look inside the luggage compartment to see how much space is on offer from this newest member of the Q family. For the size of the car, it's surprisingly large in here. And if you want to create more depth, you simply lift the floor of the compartment to drop it down. If you want more length, we can now drop each rear seat individually to add more variety for your passengers and their luggage. Spacious and versatile at the rear, let's now look inside the cockpit of the Q2 to see what it offers. The first thing you notice when you get into the car is the LED interior lighting, creating the mood that you want. There's a variety of colours and I've chosen Audi Red. The Audi Q2 is a perfect companion for my smartphone. I simply place it in the Audi phone box and it'll charge automatically. For advanced features, I can use Audi's smartphone interface. In fact, it allows me to create text messages using free speech, make phone calls, and even select the music I like from my phone without taking my hands off the wheel. I can even connect two devices simultaneously. When using the voice control system, it's as easy as chatting with your friends. The MMI operating system even understands colloquial phrases. Now I've got a party to get to tonight and it's at the Münchner Freiheit. So, navigate me to the Münchner Freiheit. Getting directions to Münchner Freiheit. Awesome. If typing is your thing, then you can use the MMI touch system or push and rotary button to input your destination. The idea is to have as few amount of operating steps as possible. The fewest amount of keys, the least amount of layers, and therefore the least amount of confusion and hopefully time saving as well. In fact, you should only have to put four letters per word into the system for it to recognize where you're going. Ah, there it is. One of my favorite parts of the Q2 is the Audi virtual cockpit. It looks fantastic and it's really high definition and sharp. It allows me, with my hands on the steering wheel, to go through my music and my playlists. I can go through my contacts on my telephone directory and make a phone call. And of course, the navigational system, fully customizable, right across and perfectly in my eye line. Right, I think I'm ready. Time to get to my party. And there they are again, those cool dynamic indicators, the LEDs illuminating from the inside outwards. I really like driving the Q2. It has such a great dynamic feel to it. It's thanks to the progressive steering, which means the quicker the input from me, the faster the car responds. It makes it feel incredibly sporty and very direct, almost a bit like a go-kart. All right, here we go. Woo! It really is great fun to drive. Ah, oh, James texted me. Jane said, Hi Ben, are you going to Nicholas's birthday? Would love to see your new car. Looks ace, Jane. Reply. Yes I am, and I've got him a present. So that's the intuitive voice control, making sending and receiving text messages super simple. Thanks to 
the systems inside the Q2, traffic jams are a thing of the past to be frustrated with. I have lane assist here, which keeps me between the two white lines and if necessary, does steering for me at low speed. I also have traffic assist down here. I pull this and systems at the front of the car detect the car in front. And if that car then begins to move, my car automatically goes with me. Absolutely fantastic. So as I say, if the car then stops again to stop me from running into him, my car slows down as well. And I'm not doing anything. It's an amazing system. I thought I'd take some side roads to avoid that massive traffic jam. Whoa! Oh, that was close. That was the Audi Presense system really saving me there. It saw, using sensors, the skateboarder coming out in front of me. It gave me a warning through the seatbelt, and then it gave me a vibration through the steering wheel, and then a visual warning all very, very quickly, and eventually actually stopped the car for me. So it braked the car. And thankfully, everyone survived unharmed. Whew, it really can save lives. A revolution is on the way. If it's a fight you want, it's a fight you get. Another great safety feature on this Q2 is the head up display. It displays the speed that I'm going at, it displays the speed limit around the area, and it also has various other driver assists, such as lane assist or indeed traffic assist icons. And it can double up as your satellite navigation system as well. A fantastic, detailed, and wonderful little feature to have inside your Q2. Aha, we have arrived, the bar. And one last trick for all my friends outside the bar. This is park assist. I simply press that button there and ultrasonic sensors scan the environment around the car looking for parking spots and then I follow the instructions. Stop the vehicle, release the wheel and put into reverse. I'm controlling the speed using the brake pedal but the steering is being done for me to optimise the space that we have and get the car into the best possible position. I simply need to follow the instructions when it comes to braking to stop the car from hitting the car behind and then change the gear back into drive and everything's done automatically. And there you have it, we have parked. Now the only worry, the parking ticket. Time to go to a party. Using the key, I don't even have to touch the luggage compartment to open it. With one button here, it locks the rear compartment and all of the doors, giving me a peace of mind. Nicholas, there you go, big present for you. Let's go for a drink. So if you want to configure your Q2, then visit the Audi website. Invincible.